Spacemax uses Magit uh, for a Git client, uh, which makes it really easy to interact with uh, your local projects and also remote projects as well. This also makes it really easy to update Spacemax, assuming you're using the development branch rather than the master branch. For example, if I open the file, um, I'm just going to open a file from emacs.d, and I'm just going to open the readme file. Um, so now I've got that, essentially I've opened the emacs.d project, so that's the Spacemax project essentially. Um, if I do space gs, uh, I can open up the git project for that. I can do ll for a long listing of all the commits, so I can see where the last commit was I, um, I pulled down, which is fairly recent. I'm going to just queue for quit out of that. Um, now I know that there's, there's a pull request I want to actually try out uh, bef uh, before merging, so um, I can actually go in and just create a um, just open a branch, and instead of that branch being um, like a local branch that I check out, um, I can actually check out a pull request by pressing Y. Uh, so press Y, and that will list me all the pull requests that are currently pushed up to the project on GitHub. And I want to uh, I want to try out uh, a closure one. So it's a big long list of things there. I'm just going to type closure, make it easier for me to find. There it is. Um, and uh, oh, there's a couple there actually. I'm going to try the uh, the top one. So I just press enter, and because uh, it's highlighted, and this will pull down and get uh, the uh, uh, pull request, which is now my local head. Uh, and I can go away and, and try out those changes in uh, in Spacemax and see if I like them, see if I've got anything I can comment to back to it. Uh, if I decide I don't really like that, I can just go back and uh, select B and just B again to check out. And I can just go back and check out uh, develop from uh, back to where I started from without uh, <coughs> without interrupting anything that I'm currently doing. So Magit and Inside Spacemax gives you a really easy way to go off and try any pull requests uh, that you're on your favorite project. And uh, I hope you found this useful. Thank you.